Hello, I'm Dr. Shin from Korea. I am the first author of the paper entitled Detection and Endoscopic Classification of Intraductal Neoplasms of the Bile Duct by Pororacolangioscopy with Narrowband Imaging. I am especially grateful to Dr. Moon for enthusiastic supervision of this study. Pororacolangioscopy can be useful for detection, characterization, and pathologic diagnosis of pre-malignant or early malignant biliary lesions through direct visualization and targeted biopsies. Among them, direct pororacolangioscopy using an ultra-slim endoscope enables optimal diagnosis of various biliary tract diseases with high-quality endoscopic imaging. Enhanced endoscopic techniques such as narrowband imaging provide additional information allowing observation of mucosa structure and microvascular patterns in detail. In this study, we investigated the visual findings of intraductal neoplasms using pororacolangioscopy with narrowband imaging and created a reliable endoscopic classification system based on surface structure and microvascular pattern. The primary outcome was the detection rate of intraductal neoplasm of the bile duct, and the secondary outcomes were the associations between cholangioscopic findings and intraductal neoplasms, the technical success of pororacolangioscopy and cholangioscopic guided forceps biopsy, and the adverse events. We proposed an endoscopic classification system as follows. Surface structure included scarring, depressed, ulcerative, polypoid, granular, villus, nodular, and papillary lesion. Microvessels were classified as no microvessels, fine reticular vessels without dilatation, regularly dilated vessels without tortuosity, regularly dilated and tortuous vessels, or irregularly dilated and tortuous vessels. As a result, direct pororacolangioscopy was technically successful in 97.2%. Among the patients, 27.8% exhibited intraductal superficial lesions of the bile duct. The technical success rate of cholangioscopy guided forceps biopsy was 94.7%. Among the 124 patients who underwent forceps biopsy, intraductal neoplasm was revealed in 54 patients, showing a detection rate of 11.8%. Papillary, nodular, and irregularly or regularly dilated and tortuous vessels were findings associated with intraductal neoplasms. The area under the receiver operating characteristic curve of the novel classification system was 0 0.899. In conclusion, pororacolangioscopy with narrowband imaging can be useful for the detection of intraductal neoplasms of the bile duct. Our novel classification system, based on both surface structure and microvascular pattern, may allow differentiation of intraductal neoplasms from intraductal superficial lesions of the bile duct. Thank you so much.